Hello, my name is Emily Stevens. I am the engineering superintendent here at Hale. I've been at Hale for a little over three years now. Um, so I'm a mining engineer. I went to West Virginia University and um, I first knew I wanted to be a mining engineer when um, my dad brought home a couple of different pieces of paper. I thought I wanted to be a lawyer. He brought home an article about a lawyer working at McDonald's and I didn't want to go through that much school and still work at McDonald's. So I filled out the paperwork for the scholarship and I was awarded the scholarship. So I went to um, went into mining. I didn't really know much about it. Um, I am fourth generation coal miner, but um, again, it, it wasn't at the forefront of what I thought I was gonna do with my life. Um, so I started underground in West Virginia. Um, and uh, moved throughout the industry, underground, surface. I have worked all over the world, um, from east coast to west coast. Uh, in Canada, I've worked overseas in Mongolia for a couple of years. Uh, it's been a very fruitful career for me. Um, I've enjoyed it immensely, and I still enjoy it. Um, so here at Hale, I manage the engineering department. I uh, have a team of about 10 um, mining engineers, geotechnical engineers, surveyors, drill and blast engineers, and we, um, the geologists alert us to where the ore body lays and we create all the plans and designs to get the ore out of the ground and uh, do all this safely so everyone goes home as they came to work every day. Um, the, some of the particular skills, again, for engineering, um, you know, math and sciences are always good, but it's also really, really good to have um, good com communication skills. Um, as, as we use science and math to create these designs and understand how, they how we're going to get the ore out of the ground, if we can't communicate those plans to everyone involved, operations, um, to other engineers, geologists, and projects people around here at site, then, then we wouldn't all meet our goals, and that is um, to, safely, to get, safely get gold ore out of the ground. Um, some of the ch challenges are um, being able to speak and communicate at many different levels many different types of people. Um, people that have been in the industry for a very long time as well as people that have just graduated from college and have come into the industry. Um, it's, it's an exciting time where you have a, a, quite the d dynamic of, of people and backgrounds, especially here at Hale because people have come from all over the world to work here. Um, but it, it's it's challenging to be able to communicate properly with everyone. It's, it's also very important to make sure that you have safety considered in all of these communications. Um, my advice to, to young people is follow your dreams. Um, and even if your dream is something different now and it evolves into something else, um, when I was eighth grade even into senior in high school I was a ballerina and thought that my career was going to be in in, in the arts and um, dancing you know for amazing ballet companies in New York City um, I traded in my tutu and my dance shoes for steel toes and a hard hat and I've never looked back it's uh, it's been very rewarding and and I would I would have advise anyone that I could to, to not settle just on one dream but maybe that dream evolves and and to go with it and, and see where it takes you.